Have you ever had a school named after you? How about a postage stamp in your honor or a day named after you? Maybe an asteroid? How about a ship? Well, probably most of, that of us have never had that, anything like that happen. But there was a little girl, just 10 years old. All of that happened to her. Her name was Samantha Smith. She became worried that there was gonna be a big nuclear war between Russia and the United States. So she said to her mom, Mom, why don't you write a letter to the new Russian president and ask him why he wants to have a war with us? And Samantha's mom said, Samantha, why don't you write the letter? So she did, and it went, Dear Mr. President, my name is Samantha Smith. I am 10 years old. Congratulations on your new job. I've been worrying about Russia and the United States getting into a nuclear war. Are you going to vote to have a war? If you aren't, please tell me how you are going to keep a war from happening. I know you don't have to tell me this, but I'd like to know why you want to conquer the world, and especially our country. Because you see, God made the world for us to live together in peace and not to fight. Sincerely, Samantha Smith. Well, she forgot about her letter, but you know what happened? About a year later, the president of Russia really did get her letter. In fact, it was all in the Russian newspapers, and everybody wanted to know what it said and was the president going to write back to her. Sure enough, he did. And everybody in the United States, all the reporters, came to her house. They wanted to know what that letter said. The president congratulated her on her courage, and he told her, Samantha, I don't want to have war. I want to have peace, peace for our country and all the countries of this planet, and for children, and for you, Samantha. And then he invited her to come to Russia. So she did with her family. She was an ambassador from the United States. And she then later went to Japan and several other countries. She became quite famous. In fact, she made some movies or some television programs. One of them was with Disney. Samantha Smith goes to Washington. Well, very sadly, when she was just 13, three years later, she and her dad were killed in a plane crash when they were coming back from a, filming one of these segments. But although her life was short, Samantha showed that young people like you can make a difference, make a big impact for what is right and for what is good in the world. They can even influence, like Samantha did, a world superpower leader. Because you see, Jesus said, blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be the sons and daughters of God.